know Christmas was made for the children. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and get started. First, I'm going to start off by priming my face and moisturizing with MAC strobe cream. And then once I get that rubbed in, I'm just going to start filling in my eyebrows. Recently, I've been feeling like my eyebrows have been a little bit too harsh for my liking. So I've changed up how I do my brows just a little bit. I'm using this Benefit Brow Pencil just to fill in like the sparse areas of my eyebrows. And then I'm going to go back in with powder later just to darken up my brows some and then fill up any um, other spaces that need to be filled in. So now I'm just going in with uh, ash brown powder and soft brown powder from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I'm filling in my brows with her um, number 12 brush. You guys already know this is my favorite brow brush ever. And then now I'm going to carve out underneath my brow. Now this product is just an eye primer, but it's literally like a concealer. So I'm using it to carve out my brows and then I'm going to use it to prime my eyes. Once I get the powder distributed evenly all over my eyelids, I'm just going to set it with like a loose translucent powder. Um, I'm obsessed with this CoverGirl powder, it's so good. But once I get that set, I'm just going to start on my eyes. And I'm going to take a soft, kind of peachy color and place that in my upper crease. And this is just going to help blend out the colors that I place down afterwards. And now I'm going to take a little bit of a darker, um, more of like a, a mustardy kind of warmish orangey color I guess you could say and I'm just gonna start blending that out in my crease um, I'm still using that same color I'm just adding more and more and more and then I'm gonna go in and add a darker brown in my outer V and I'm just gonna blend that up into my crease okay so I'm still blending and I have the brush turned sideways and I'm just blending it more towards my inner um, lid and then I'm gonna turn the brush more flat I guess you could say and pack that color on and then I'm going to turn it back the other way and start sliding it back and forth to help blend up that color and then I'm going to place Mirage on my lid from Makeup Geek and then I'm going to blend everything out together and, and then I'm going to get started on my other eye um, obviously I'm going to make it look exactly like what you guys just watched and then I'm going to start on my winged eyeliner Okay, so for the majority of my eyeliner, I do use this NYX eyeliner, but it does dry down glossy on me, so I go back over it with this Tarte eyeliner afterwards, and I've been loving this Tarte eyeliner. It's super, super black, and it dries matte, and it does not transfer on me, and I haven't noticed it transferring on my clients either, so I really, really like it. And then I'm going to take Too Faced Glitter Glue, and I'm going to place that on my lower lash line with a blending brush from Sigma and I'm going to take a darker green glitter and then I'm going to go back in with this really pretty lighter green glitter on my lower lash line as well just to make it pop and I'm going to kind of create more of like a line that's going away from my wing for my um, ornament to hang on once I draw them on and my NYX white eyeliner is dried out so that's why you see my the handle to my ornament kind of go a little wonky um, but yeah I'm just going to let you guys watch this it's kind of self-explanatory Okay, so now I'm going to start applying this cream highlighter with my Beauty Blender. This is one of my favorite highlighters at the moment. It's Flexitarian from ColourPop. It is so, 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 so pretty. Um, Thomas showed this to us when we were in San Francisco, and I am obsessed. I'm so glad he shared it because I cannot stop using it. And then I'm going to go back in with two powder highlighters because I'm just so extra. Um, but you guys already know I have that 50% discount code for you guys. So go ahead and snag it while you can. And then I'm just going to pop on some blush and start lining my lips. And then fill them in with Ruby Woo from MAC. After that, you're all set to go. I hope you guys have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Happy Holidays. I love you guys so, so much. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.